going to start it, and all you need to do is focus like on one where you're right at. Where I'm working, yeah, and I've got it kind of okay. telephotoed up. There. I'll be my oh ugh. That well, I'll terrible. tell you what. If you go look at uh, the channel, um, um, you'll see that yours are by far not the worst. Oh, this is this is uh, so. Hang you on. know, every time I went to see doctor, and I was going to call him and ask. For most him. diabetics, what we do is we'll have you come in on a regular routine basis uh -huh. every few months. Good. And if this hurts a little bit today because they're so long, uh -huh. um, we can, it, it won't hurt quite as much. Next time? Right. So, in other words, I should come back. Well, what I would <laughs> recommend is that you make your next appointment on your way out from this one. Oh, okay. Then we get you back in. Two to three months usually. Okay. Uh, how late are you open at night? Yeah, he's a good guy. He's a yes. very good endocrinologist. Yes, he is. I like him very much. And I started going to him for my uh, thyroid mm -hmm. because I had gotten. Uh, my husband was going to the side doctor, and uh, he it was recommended to him by anyway. She, uh, Marilyn, do your job. <laughs> anyway, uh, she said, "Okay, you're my doc. You you are now my patient. Get up here." Oh wow! I had uh, Graves' disease. My eyes were so poppy, mm -hmm. and that and. Uh, so she took care of all of that, and then she said, you know, you should see somebody. And I had been seeing the family doctor, but everything was fine with my thyroid. Okay. Yeah, so she sent me to doctor. And I've been there ever since. This is going to feel so much better when we're done. Good. And I'm not going to go down deep enough to get the skin or make it hurt or anything. Good. Oh, please don't. No, I won't. When they're this thick. Yeah, they are terrible thick. Yeah, but they, they do come off in um, chunks. Uh -huh. I, can, I can see. Yeah. Is that nail going to grow straight? No. It never will? No, it's never going to grow like your other one. Ow. Yeah, when I called to make the appointment, I said, okay, now could you tell me just whereabouts are you? Mm -hmm. And Highway 100. Oh, sure, I know, Highway 100. Okay. And uh, I said, okay, anywhere near Golden Valley Road? Yeah, before that. And I said, okay. Then I think we know where you are. There's a Byerly's over there. Yeah. She said, yeah, right bias and mm -hmm. then uh, and Honeywell used to be over this way someplace. It still is, yeah. Yeah. My husband never worked there but he worked at the one on Stinson and mm -hmm. St. Louis Park and mm -hmm. yeah. you see how it's just, just coming off in chunks here. I see that. Yeah. You know, I'm not the best picture taker here. You know what? You're doing fine. You're getting what you're getting. Exactly. And it'll I'm either sorry. be usable or it won't and it doesn't matter. Okay. Um, I'm more interested in getting your nails taken care of. Oh. Okay. So let me just do a different clipper here. And do the other foot. Okay. Mm. Most people don't get to watch this close up like you. No. I imagine not. So for diabetic patients, um, the Medicare rule is that it has to be at least two months in between visits. Uh-huh. But I find that most people don't need to come even that frequently. 
Oh. So we start you out at like two and a half months. Okay. And then at your next appointment, if you say, ooh, I feel like that was too long, we uh -huh. can shorten it up. Or if you say, I could have gone another few weeks, we oh. can go to three months. Oh, okay. So most people come in somewhere between every two and three months. Ah, okay. Because I know at the senior center, mm -hmm. they have somebody come in and clip nails. Okay. And... Sorry. That's okay. This one I think wins the prize. Oh, that is... It's very, it's a big long one. Yeah. Do you want to keep it as a trophy when no. we're done? No. Okay. I, I can't imagine this didn't hurt in your shoes. You know, it didn't. I'm surprised too. I'm surprised I could walk. No. She will be furious at me. Why? No, no need to be furious. Look, it's uh, when people have other health issues, this is something that they don't often think about. And it's uh, hard to get at. They, they, I was able to get at them, except they got so dang thick. Mm -hmm. And I just... And if you don't have the strength in your hands, uh -huh. then, you know, that can be a problem. So. Right. Yeah, so yeah. that's what we're here for. I've lost the strength. Gradually it's gone. Okay. Now, some people will also, because I make them, I get them short, I get them comfortable, um, I don't leave them gorgeous. Uh huh. But so a lot of people will treat themselves to a pedicure the day after. Oh. So, so just something to think about if uh -huh. you know anyone who does pedicures or. Well, senior centers do. Okay. So I could make an appointment. They only come every so often, though, as far as I know. For many, many petties? Yeah. Okay. 